YouTube. Okay, so it just happened. It just dropped. I was doing a review for one of my one of my friends' uh, movies that just came out, and then I was doing like uh, that uh, Legends of Tomorrow. Uh, I was doing the reaction video for that. So I just looked online, and I can confirm that the Spider-Man for the Marvel Cinematic Universe um, has been announced. It's official. And I'm going to go ahead and read what they're saying. So, just in, it looks like Marvel Studios and Sony Pictures Entertainment have found their new shared Spider-Man. We've been sitting information since Friday, but can now confirm now that his reps and Marvel are under negotiations. It's all about the formalities now. Then and now officially announced from Marvel the following shortly. So there's going to be probably a major outing of this. Um, but basically, the person that they've picked is Asa Butterfield. So if any of y'all seen, uh, dang, I about said Zone of Enders, Enders Game, uh, then that is the main actor uh, that plays in that. And he's, he's a good actor. Uh, I think he also played in Hugo with, uh, what is her name? Chloe Grace from Rats. Um, and honestly, he was he was one of the five that they was they were selecting potentially. Out of everybody, I honestly wanted him if they weren't gonna bring back like Tobey Maguire or <laughs> or Andrew Garfield. I was really hoping for Andrew Garfield to be back. I don't know who uh, Martin Freeman is gonna be. I'm kind of like thrown through a loop with that. But for them to officially announce and have him gonna be in it. So I'm pretty sure they're going to have him actually on post-production. Now, one of the scarier things is I saw with one of my friends, he had posted up a link uh, about, like, the same as I think. But the link, it actually showed, uh, I guess, what was supposed to be a video of Spider-Man, like, slinging up the Avengers logo. Uh, I thought that was really cool. Uh, I'll, show you, I'll show that to you. Hold on one second. Here it is. Mind not the names. <laughs> Is. Totally fan made, from what I'm understanding. It's totally fan made, but without a fact, like I, I just, I think I'm kind of in shock because I couldn't believe they announced it. I knew that because Civil War was starting the production, that they, that Spider-Man is gonna be a part of Civil War, no matter what. But I was like, eventually it's gonna have to come out like who's gonna be the actor that's gonna be the main character, you know? And now that they've actually got it, like I don't know what to think about it, y'all. I, I I really don't know what to say. I showed Joe and Joe was like, okay. Everybody generally has been with this thought process of, well, at least it, it could be a lot worse, you know? And not just that, he's kind of got this geeky prowess about himself and how he carries himself. So I'm entertaining this. Like I, I'm excited to see what they're gonna do with it. I don't like the fact that they're bringing Peter Parker back to high school. I, I that feels such like a cop out to me. Like I don't want to see him back in high school. I want to see him progress as a man, like Spider Man, not Spider Boy. You know. Um, so I mean, I understand what they're trying to do. I try, I, I have some faith in. Um, Kevin Feige, uh, I don't have faith in AVR Red. I don't know why he still got him on the production team for that or for Black Panther. Um, but Civil War, I think that having him in it uh, and having this actor be playing the role of Peter Parker, I think that that, that intrigues me. I'm, I'm interested to see what they do with it. Hopefully they don't screw it over. I think that their end game and be all to doing this was really to have somebody that would last for another 10 to 15 years. And so there's probably no telling what his contract's gonna be up for, but when they officially do make the official announcement, and this is not like the Latino reviews or everybody else is just kind of like making this like a, a rumor mill thing, I'm pretty sure that he is gonna be this this main cast person. Um, but when the official release comes out, I'm gonna be back, me and Joe are gonna talk about it, and we'll give you an insight. But I wanted to give y'all my first reaction and thoughts about this. So I don't. There's not gonna be any pictures up here. There's not gonna be anything until the official release comes out, which I hope and I pray that the official release, just kind of like how they did uh, Bradwick Chadwick, 
um, that they do an actual picture of what Spider-Man's gonna look like. Or even the boy and like how he looks as Peter Parker. That'd be even cooler. So stay tuned for that. I'm gonna be back. But I definitely want to let y'all know that the official word is that Asa Butterfield is going to be Spider-Man in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. So Spider-Man is home! I'm out. Later, everybody.